Have you ever pondered what powers our journeys into the great beyond, the cosmos? The answer lies in the magic of rocket engines. But where did this magic begin? It all started with the ancient Greeks. They invented a steam-powered device known as the Eolipil, marking the first recorded use of a reaction engine. But it was the Chinese who took things to the next level. They invented gunpowder, which was an early form of solid rocket fuel. This invention was a game-changer. It sparked a new age in rocketry and was a vital stepping stone towards the development of modern rocket engines. These early advancements were pivotal. They laid the groundwork for the technology that would one day allow us to break free from Earth's gravitational pull and venture into the cosmos. So the journey of rocket engines started thousands of years ago, and it's been a thrilling ride since. The 20th century brought about a seismic shift in rocketry with the advent of liquid propellants. When we think of pioneers in rocketry, one name that comes to mind is Robert H. Goddard. This visionary scientist successfully launched the world's first liquid-fueled rocket on a crisp March day in 1926. The flight lasted a mere two and a half seconds, but it marked a turning point in the history of space exploration. So, what's the big deal about liquid propellants? Well, let's delve into the workings of liquid-fueled engines. These engines operate on a basic principle. They burn a mix of liquid fuel and oxidizer to produce high-pressure and high-temperature gases. These gases are then expelled through a nozzle, propelling the rocket in the opposite direction, as dictated by Newton's third law of motion. One significant advantage of liquid propellants over their solid counterparts is controllability. With a liquid-fueled engine, you can adjust the thrust mid-flight by controlling the rate of fuel flow. This ability to throttle makes liquid engines ideal for missions requiring precision, like landing a spacecraft on the moon. Speaking of moon landings, the mighty Saturn V that propelled the Apollo missions into space was powered by liquid engines. This colossal rocket, standing taller than the Statue of Liberty, had a first stage powered by five F-1 engines. These engines burned a combination of kerosene and liquid oxygen, producing a thunderous seven and a half million pounds of thrust. It was this power that allowed Apollo astronauts to break free from Earth's gravitational pull and set course for the moon. The advent of liquid propellants revolutionized space travel. It enabled us to design more powerful and controllable rockets, paving the way for humanity's first steps on the moon and beyond. With this development, we took a giant leap, literally and metaphorically, into a new era of space exploration. As we ventured further into space, the need for more powerful and efficient engines grew. With the dawn of the space age came the era of solid propellants. These represented a significant stride in rocket technology, offering a myriad of advantages that helped propel humanity further into the cosmos. Solid propellants, as the name suggests, are solid in nature. They are essentially a mixture of fuel and oxidizer, mixed and processed into a solid mass. The beauty of these propellants lies in their simplicity and reliability. There are no moving parts involved, making them less prone to mechanical failure. One of the key advantages of solid propellants was their ability to provide higher thrust. This is because all the energy stored in the propellant is released almost instantaneously. This gave rockets the initial push they needed to break free from Earth's gravitational pull. Another advantage of solid propellants is their ease of storage. They can be stored for long periods without degradation, making them ideal for space missions that might take years to plan and execute. But the quest for better rocket engines didn't stop at solid propellants. Enter hybrid engines, an ingenious combination of liquid and solid propellants. These engines sought to marry the best of both worlds. Hybrid engines use a solid fuel and a liquid or gaseous oxidizer. This unique configuration allows for a safer and more controlled ignition and burn rate than purely solid or liquid engines. This is because the oxidizer flow can be regulated allowing for the thrust to be adjusted during flight. In modern space travel, hybrid engines have found their place, propelling spacecrafts with efficiency and precision. They have been used in various missions, from launching satellites to ferrying supplies to the International Space Station. The evolution of rocket engines has been a testament to human innovation and ingenuity. From the dawn of rocket engines to the age of solid propellants and hybrid engines, each development has been a stepping stone, pushing the boundaries of what we thought possible and propelling humanity further into the vast expanse of space. As we stand on the cusp of a new era in space travel, what does the future hold for rocket engines? Well, 
The possibilities are as infinite as the cosmos itself. There's a lot of buzz around nuclear propulsion, a technology that could potentially shorten our trips to Mars from months to weeks. Imagine the possibilities. We're also seeing advancements in ion drives, which use electric power to create thrust. Although they offer a slower acceleration, ion drives are incredibly efficient, making them ideal for long-duration space missions. In addition, researchers are exploring other cutting-edge technologies like plasma propulsion and antimatter engines. These advancements could completely revolutionize the way we travel through space, making interstellar exploration a reality. So as we gaze into the future of rocketry, we see a vision of faster, more efficient and more sustainable space travel. The journey of rocket engines is far from over, in fact it's just getting started. Space, the final frontier, and rocket engines, the marvels that take us there. In this journey, we've explored the dawn of rocketry, from its humble beginnings to the monumental achievements of today. We've seen how the era of liquid propellants revolutionized space travel, opening new horizons and taking us further than ever before. Then, the age of solid propellants and hybrid engines arrived, carrying the torch of innovation and setting the stage for a new chapter in our cosmic saga. But the story of rocketry is far from over. The future holds untold possibilities, with new technologies on the horizon that promise to propel us deeper into the cosmos. As we stand at the precipice of this new era, one thing remains certain. It's the magic of rocket engines that makes our cosmic dreams a reality. Thank you for joining us on this journey through time and space. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more fascinating insights into the universe we inhabit.